Next, we visit Peru, where workers' rights seem to be non-existent for those who transport food that feeds citizens. Teresu's Rael Moro filed this report. Benito Alarcón has been a stevedore for 29 years at the largest food wholesaler in Peru, which serves most markets for the almost 10 million residents of the capital of Lima. Like for most of his peers, his job consists of carrying large bags of vegetables weighing over 100 kilos from the trucks to the stalls. The weight carried is over twice the amount legally permitted and it puts the health of the worker at risk. I climbed up this one board and it slipped and I fell with everything, the board and the mesh bag. The mesh hit me on my heel and on my ankle and it swelled like a ball and I couldn't work for practically a month and for that month off there is no government support or anything for us the working class. In addition to occupational hazards from carrying large weights in excess of five hours a day, over time the stevedores develop permanent spine, knees and ankle complications and many end up handicapped. Also, they do not receive paid sick leave, health and occupational insurances or any other type of social benefits. The state has to intervene subsidizing or making the law be obeyed, nothing else, because at the root of the problem there is the health and that is the most important part, human life before economic benefits. That is what it's all about, the essence of it all. The stevedores are conscious of the dangers they are facing at work and they are preparing to take action. Through the labor union, they are holding an organizing conference, strategizing to increase their numbers and push the government to make regulations that affect their livelihoods be respected. Rael Mora, Telesur, Peru.